All right, so welcome back to another video. We're playing some more Scarlet Nexus, and I was gonna continue the main story, but we got a few Bond episodes we gotta do. We got this one, and then we got this guy's. So might as might as well just do them since we have them already. So yeah, we'll start with Sigumis, I guess. Here we go. Nope. Actually, hang on. Yeah, I'll give her this real quick. All right, so, so that's there. That's kind of cool, actually. Um, let's go do the bond episode. Oh, Yuito, I would like to talk to you. Hmm. What's up, Sugumi? I think I finally found that flower. Look at this. Oh. It's called a silent snowmelt. It's a rare flower that only blooms at high altitudes. Is this the one you saw? Yeah, this is the one. That's incredible. I can't believe you found it with such little info. This flower's natural environment is different from Suo's climate. So it took some time to find. What does that mean? It blooms on cold high mountains. So the temperature in your garden is too high. Growing it would be difficult. Oh. I guess that's why they always wilted. No, it's amazing that the flowers bloomed at all. I would like to try growing them myself, but... Is there a problem? Oh, you did say it was a rare flower. Yes, you can't normally get seeds or sprouts. There isn't any data about its natural habitat either. There isn't any information about how to collect them yourself or where to look. I'm stuck. Hmm. Okay. Let's see. If they were in my garden, that means they probably grow somewhere in New Himuka. I... I want to search for this flower. Honestly, I felt bad about leaving all the searching to you, so I looked into it a little myself. The gardener who planted this flower already passed away, so I haven't got a single clue where he got it. That's sad. I'm sure he was good at what he did. Yeah, he spent a lot of time and care to raise it in our garden. And I figured out why I remembered this flower in the first place. After my mom died, I was really sad for a very long time. The old gardener, he knew she liked those flowers, so he planted them for me. I see. So I'm glad I know their name at least. Thank you. But you haven't seen the actual flowers yet. It must be frustrating. Still, that's good enough for me. Thanks to your thorough research, I can look at pictures of the flower whenever I want. You want to see the real thing, don't you? I'll check some more. Huh? Oh, well... I'd like to see it if I can, but you don't have to go out of your way. I promised I would find it, so I don't want to give up. Okay. Thanks, Sugumi. And I'll help in any way I can. Okay. She was really excited. She can be pretty stubborn sometimes. I didn't know that about her. Although, the fact that she let me see her like that means she's starting to open up. That makes me kind of happy. Alright, we got one more and then we got to continue the main story. Problems? Um, I think things are fine right now. If you need anything, just tell me. I want to help you. I may not be very useful, but I'm here for you. Look at this guy just meditating over here. I like his story the most. I think I've this is probably like the most interesting. Too. We're the same. Let's talk to this guy. How have you been feeling lately, Yuito? I'm feeling great. Thanks for asking. Of course. Make sure to rest when you need it. Part of being OSF is taking care of your body. See you around. Are you going to work out now? 
Yes, my daily routine. Would you like to join me? Light exercise is good for maintaining your health. You're right. Okay, I'll work out with you. Maybe you can make a training program for me. I would be happy to. I promise to make the program that best suits your body type and fighting style. Great, thanks. Ugh, I'm beat. I'm so thirsty. Do you want some water, Luca? <sighs> no, you should drink it. I have this. What is that? A special protein drink that I concocted. It's best to drink it within 45 minutes of exercising. I've never had one. Is it good? I made it strawberry flavored, so it's easy to drink. The intake of protein is essential for building muscle. Not only do you work out, you even worry about your nutrition. That's amazing. Protein is well known to people who like exercise. It's nothing to be surprised about. It's not just that. The program you just went through was pretty hard. You're really stoic about it. Why do you want to train so much? Well, because I'm small. When compared to those around me, I'm always at a strength disadvantage. So I want to do all I can to lessen that disadvantage. A strength disadvantage? But why does that matter? There's almost no one as good as you in a real fight. You are a Septentrion, and you have top-class strength when it comes to a fight with powers. I do not want to rely solely on my power. Why not? You have an amazing one. I don't see the problem in relying on it. Let me put it another way. Power is something you are born with. It cannot easily be changed. However, muscles are different. The harder you work, the stronger they become. Isn't that amazing? Huh. Um... I guess it does seem pretty amazing, maybe. Yes, you're beginning to understand. Also, my brother is always ahead of me. No matter how much praise I get, I can never equal him. That makes me want to work hard. I see. I definitely understand that. Thank you for saying so. Since you're here, I'll tell you my secret. What is it? Wait just a moment. This is the backpack you always wear. Oh, that's heavy. What's in this? I've made adjustments to my daily routine to train my muscles. I have weights inside my clothes as well. You call them adjustments, but it sounds like torture to me. These extreme methods might be the secret to his strength. Will you put some weights in my clothes too? Of course. They are custom made to be removable. So I will put this here, and there you are. Great. Now I'll try to walk. Whoa! Oh, my body is swaying just from moving a little. <laughs> it's not very heavy, but it will be difficult until you are used to using your core. You can borrow them if you like. Now, I'll do another set. You can keep going? Yes, I still have a lot left to do. You can take a rest if you are tired. That's a Septentrion for you. I can't believe he always wears weights. But there's something kind of desperate about the way he's exercising. I feel like he's pushing himself too hard. Can he really handle it? I never expected you to be so odd, Yuito. Huh? Really? I thought I was pretty normal. What is normal in the OSF is not what most people call normal. It's very intriguing. I think I'm starting to understand you a little better. Really? I'm so happy to hear you say that. Alright, finally. Okay, so... Yeah, we did all the bind-ups that we can do here. Let's go ahead and continue on the main story. And then... Here we go. We're going to stand by phase seven I now. Should try to get a little rest. Mm -hmm. A message from Major General Fubuki? It's Fubuki. I want an update on your situation. Rendezvous where we met previously. 
I got a message from Major General Fabuki. Did everyone else get it too? I did. I did too. I think he's talking about the safe zone. He said he's under surveillance, so I am sure he just wanted to play it safe. But Major General Fubuki is with Spring Pharmaceuticals, right? Those ampules. Do you think he knows about that factory? It would be strange if he didn't. He might have a purpose for calling a meeting so soon afterwards. The fact that the OSF hospital prescribed the drugs must mean the government's getting products from that factory in some shape or form. Could Major General Fubuki be the go-between? Does that mean he's an enemy too? Even after everything he's done for us? Hmm. It could just be one of the ways he goes about pretending to obey the government. We can sit here and doubt his intentions all day, but we're better off just asking. You have a big heart, Yuito. Your trusting nature is one of your most likable features. I should really follow your example. It's because he's sincere. I think our skepticism might provide him a nice balance. <laughs> that might be true. Sorry to call you out here. While I accepted Luca's generous invitation the last time, I feel it would be dangerous for me to frequent your hideout. There's a good chance the team surveilling me will notice. We appreciate your consideration. Wataru told me what happened in Ceyron. I've also given the government a report that won't affect our activities. What? Is that safe? Your family is spring pharmaceuticals. That's precisely why I did. Reporting my own family's wrongdoings only gets the government to trust me more. Besides, Karin and I were the first ones to propose that research facility. What? I think you already know about Alice. She's still being held in that facility as an other. We enticed Ceyron in order to protect her, knowing full well they would abuse their research. The results of which were the ampules and the uprising. We were fools. What's going on with this country? Ceyron may have incited an uprising, but there's still a new Himuka city just like ours. Suo's conducting human experiments, and Ceyron is basically doing the same thing. All of it being done to develop new weapons to fight the threat of the others. One chose to strengthen powers, and one explored a method to control the others themselves. What are others, anyway? I've heard they suddenly began appearing after the Spring of Extinction, but not much is known about them still. That's true. I guess the only other thing we know is that they're created in the Extinction Bell. Some are saying they're wild animals that experience sudden mutations, but are they really wild? It's very possible that the government is hiding what they actually are. That is the crux of it. Huh? Even the public can sense something different about the others. So, focusing on that point will nullify the government's personality rehabilitation efforts. Like exposing a government secret to every new Himuka citizen? Just like my brother did in the uprising. Exactly. Karan and I once plotted to send a video of a human at the moment of being metamorphosed straight to the minds of every citizen. But we couldn't find any definitive video to serve as our evidence, and I was hampered after they threatened Karan. So that's why you let the government turn you into a spy? Yes. But now they should have Nagi's data from when Naomi was metamorphosed for research purposes. They took his memory when they subjected him to personality rehabilitation. Now that you mention it, Nagi seemed like he had no idea about Naomi's metamorphosis after he was discharged from the hospital. But, but wouldn't that cause brain damage? Extracting a specific memory is a dangerous process, but that's hardly even a concern to them. You all have the same memory of her metamorphosis, but attempting to digitize and extract it is too risky. That's why we need Nagi's stored memory data. It's already been extracted. We can send the data via Arahabaki to every citizen as proof of the government's inhumane acts. The people are ready to hear it. Can you access it? Yes. I received permission to enter the secure site while you were heading out to Ceyron on your last assignment. 
I've been provided with a one-time use pass. Nagi's stolen memory, where is it stored? I think they're storing it in the old OSF hospital you infiltrated before. I'm sorry for not having more concrete intel, but that facility was used to research powers. It's very likely it's there. Could you infiltrate the old hospital after the platoon has been reorganized? Reorganized? Uh, I forgot about that. I'm... I'm staying in Yuita, platoon. This isn't... This isn't the world I want either. I see. So Hanabi is the only one that needs to be transferred. No, I'll stay too. Are you sure? Staying with us could mean being targeted by the government. Then we'll deal with it if it comes to that. After all the awful things we learned, I can't just sit here and do nothing while my friends are trying to do something about it. You don't care if it brings trouble to your family? No. And I'm actually starting to suspect that it wasn't just my uncle who knew, but my father too. Thank you, Hanabi. Your help means a lot to me. I'll leave you to recover Nagi's memory from Naomi's metamorphosis. I'd like to go myself, but I don't want them revoking my access to Arahabaki, so I have to lay low for now. You've made a lot of waves, Yuito. You need to be careful. This will be your second time infiltrating the hospital. Yes, I will. By the way, I can send you some data to help you bypass the old hospital security system. I may not be as good as my sister, but I can still put together a program or two. Please use this to aid your infiltration. Thank you. Well, good luck. All right, so I guess we're going back to the hospital. So I kind of knew some shit like that was going to happen. Where everyone's going to stay, you know? So, yeah, we're good. Oh, let's see. So we got to go to the hospital. And we were just here not too long ago. All right, here we go, guys. This place again. This place looks kind of crazy. What the hell? Look at this guy. Holy shit. I don't know, man. That's kind of... I kind of feel weird to commentate right now. I don't know. I just need coffee. I'm a little tired still. But... I will see how it goes. I'll probably finish up this video, get some coffee, and then... Continue playing. So... Oh, here we go. There we go. Yeah, that's kind of so damn creepy, man. With? Even with, like, all the... Um, allies you have, you know? So... Look at that. Why do they even have cameras and stuff? Not cameras. Or, yeah, cameras. Holograms. Let's go this way. What is this? Alright. But this, this is probably one of the... Disrupt the security okay. system with Major General Fubuki's program. You can proceed safely. Understood. Like this place is hella creepy, but it's probably my favorite like area to explore. There's something about it. Okay, we gotta teleport over here. There we go. Jesus. Man, these guys are invisible, man. I don't like using this ability that much. Cause I don't know. It's kind of lame. I like the eye though when you power up with this. It's kind of sick. Hang on. Get this. Throw one of these. Another one of these. There we go. Is that it? Okay, more. Oh, this guy. Oh, this guy's new actually. Holy fuck. I'm gonna... Hmm. Teleportation. Holy fuck. Yeah, these guys are crazy. Alright. Hang on. I should probably get rid of the henchman for actually let's use this. Hold this. One of these. And then hit one more of these. Damn, can this guy like drop down? There we go. Damn, I'm barely doing any damage though. Hang on. I'm gonna get the execution on him. Hang on. What the hell? There we go. Okay, lame. I thought it was gonna be something new. It's just the henchmen now. Holy fuck. 
Yeah, I bought like new armor. So, like I'm a little tankier. But I feel like <laughs> I'm not that tanky really. They still do a lot. Alright, cut this up. Holy fuck. Yeah, I'm gonna try to finish this game. Probably this weekend. And then we'll see how it goes. I really want to play Monster Hunter Story. But like, might be a little too late for that. Came out like yesterday. We'll see. We'll use this. Power up. Hang on. Can this guy die? Alright. So this is where we came from, I think. So we gotta go through here. Right? How's that sound? Look at these guys. Got the sound, man. It's just kind of scary. Throw this at them. Here we go. One more. Never mind. Okay, so there's something over here we can grab. What's this all about? Hmm. Yeah, I don't know where to go. Like, I don't know if I'm going the right way or not. Let's go this way. And then... Hmm. This way? Gonna grab this on the toilets. Oh, there's a shopkeeper over here. Let's go ahead and save up. I need more jelly, too, so I'll get some. All right, there we go. Yeah, it just feels so weird, man. Like I usually drink like, a cup of coffee before I like start a video, and I just don't feel right. You know, <laughs> kind of feels weird. Damn, I'm broke as hell. Hang on. Okay, that should be good enough. There's that. And then... Okay, so... So we're right here. Hmm. We gotta go this way. Hang on, guys. So we go... Oh, hold up. I think we're going the right way. Holy shit, look at this guy. So I'm not overdriving a bit. Hang on, guys. It's gonna... Oh, no damage. What the hell? Okay, so you gotta wait until... Like, he starts shooting you, and then you can... You hit him. There we go. Oh, about a... Here we go. Hopefully this is different. Okay, lame. Same thing. All right. That's so lame and how like you have to use your power up. There we go. Hang on. Is that it? Brain drive. Brain drive. Hang on. Oh, are they invisible? Look at these guys. All right. You know, I can't wait till if you do Kasane story, you don't have to deal with like the invisible enemies. I don't think. I don't think so. I hope not. Let's use this. Jesus Christ. Okay, so I have my brain field thing. I'll probably save it for boss fights. Hopefully there's a cool one. Like, the last few boss fight has been... Like, pretty much just Kasane's team. Holy fuck. I'm gonna use this. Alright. Jesus. Holy fuck. Can I get this? Alright. I wonder if... Do I blink to him by use? Kinda lame. Cut him up. Holy fuck. Look at this guy. He's a fire attack. Well, that's kinda sick. There we go. Let's finish this. All right. That's kind of a waste. We'll be able to move 
forward if we use my power, you need help. Time to use this. Hmm. What else we got? More jelly? Max jelly. Well, that'll be useful. And there's nothing in this room. Just for that max jelly. Some help, Luca. Alright, let's check the map again. Okay, we're supposed to go down here. I think. Okay, hang on. Do you remember the layout of the building? You were admitted to this hospital with Okay, so I'm actually kind of confused now. Okay, so we're right here. Okay, it's because the map got turned. Hang on. Okay, there we go. All right, we're supposed to go this way. Hang on, guys. Okay, yeah, this way for sure. I think I, I think I got it finally. I don't remember it at all. I guess I was too young. Hmm. How did I end up here? Hang on, guys. So. That's stupid. Okay, so I think the map's like rotating with me. <laughs> Alright. Let's go out. Let me see something real quick. Okay, yeah, that's actually messing me up like a lot. <laughs> okay, let's go. Okay, you can't really rely on the big map. Shit's like confusing me. So we'll just use the mini one, I guess. We're always together, but I also look forward to spending even more time with you. I think this way. Okay, yeah, we're getting really close finally. This place is kind of confusing, man. That whole map was tripping me out. I was like, what is going on? Like, I kept like teleporting around, you know? But just because they kept turning around. Is that it? Probably a big wave after this one. These guys are kind of weak. Okay, here we go. Yeah, look at them. That's my favorite combo. Like the fire and like teleportation is really good for like waves of enemy. And then for boss fights, like gamma and fire is really good. This guy's crazy. Holy fuck. Okay, let's go and use gamma real quick. Can I get up? Alright. Hey, this guy, man. I need to break a shield. Jesus. Fuck, there's like... Is there two of them? Holy fuck. Okay, there we go. Let's finish this. Alright, here we go. I'm trying, man. Gotta finish this before he gets up. Oh, bullshit. Okay, there we go. Can use this. Okay, hang on. No, oh, there we go. Look at this guy. This guy's tanky for like no reason. Okay, hang on. All right, hang on, guys. I'm trying. Damn, this guy's hella annoying. Can this guy die? Oh, there we go. Come on, here we go. I don't think I can break this time. Hang on. Okay, there we go. Pretty good. Well, this is kind of new. That's so cool. And look at this guy, he's just chilling. All right, let's go and restock on some stuff. Oops, wrong button. Hang on, guys. Do we need more of these? I can actually afford them this time. Okay. Let's keep on going. Okay, we're going the right way. This place is too damn confusing. Whoa, look at this guy, just chilling. We're going up. Clear 
Hmm. Discretion is the better part of valor. Down here, maybe? I would like to be useful for once. Alright. Is there an enemy somewhere? Yeah, this game would be a really good horror game, man. Like, if they just... If you weren't able to, like, slice them up, you know? For, like, defenseless, gotta run around. But, yeah, since you can fight back, it's not as scary. He's in the way. Can we go this way? I don't even know. Okay, light jelly. We already have good health too, so yeah, I don't know. Okay, so we gotta go down. Down here. Hang on guys. And then through here. Man, this sucks. I don't like this at all. Like, so damn confusing. Okay, we gotta go through here. This game wasn't that confusing before. Hmm. Okay, and I went the wrong way. Hang on this way. Some help, Luca. I need you, Gemma. Okay, down here. Okay, you can't even go this way. Go through here, though. Nothing in here. Okay, do we go downstairs now? I think so. The fuck, man. Okay, so now you go back upstairs. There's enemies. Where's this lead? God, why am I so confused about this? Hang on. So this way. Okay, here we go. I think I found it. Actually, no, I didn't. Okay, I think I figured it out. Okay, so, yeah, you go this way. Yeah, here we go. This is it right here. Holy fuck. I hate this guy, man. You just gotta wait until you start shooting, and then you can hit him. Can I get up? Hang on, guys. All right, fuck it. Just gonna use some of these. Can this guy start shooting, man? Is he actually just gonna... Here we go. God, this guy's actually... Is he really gonna be like this? Get ready. If your body begins to burn with fire, it'll drain your health. So hmm. be careful. I guess, yeah, let's go ahead and get the henchmen. And then... Yeah, we'll get this main guy. He's just gonna sit there, because he's a little bitch. <laughs> oh, here we go. Oh. He's actually so annoying. One good hit, and then you pretty much get him down. I don't know, he's just gonna sit there, I guess, and shoot, and then defend. Hang on. Get rid of these guys. Alright. Hang on, guys. Hang on. Oh my god, hang on. Are you serious? Okay, I feel like... Hang on, you're supposed to teleport on him, maybe. Okay, there we go. That works. You're just gonna leave it down if you get really close to him. Is that it? Go over here. And this guy. Hang on. 
hit this guy, I guess. God, I hate tanky as enemies too, man. There's just so many damn annoying enemies in this game. Like flying ones are pretty annoying. Tanky ones. That one we just fought with like the shield. Fuck, hang on, you gotta kill this guy before he gets up. Hang on, guys. Oh, he's in the shell. I'm trying, man. <laughs> Let's finish it off. We gotta use clairvoyance. Holy fuck. Here we go. Jesus. Finish it off. Jesus, man. Alright. So now we go down this way. I want to get out of here. This place is too damn confusing for me. All these like levels and different like places you gotta go through. Whoa! I'm using the Sugumi. That was that. Break the outer shell. Keep attack. All right, kind of heal. Thanks, Nabi. And then use this. All right. Cut him up. Come on. Okay, gamma is done. Okay, there we go. Hang on. You know what? Hang on. I want to use this on him. Don't get up. That work? I like this one. Oh, tap. One more. That's kind of lame. Alright, all these guys. I didn't even see them. Alright, cut them up. Go burn him out, burn him up. I mean, all right, here we go. Jesus, oh, this guy gotta back up and then just blink to him. There we go. That's so annoying. Okay, at least I figure out how to take care of him. Is there more? Look at Gamma just chilling right there. Here we go. One of these. We're about to get our drive thing again. We get that back so quick. Like every few fight we get it pretty much. Alright, here we go. There we go. One of these. One of these. Holy fuck. Let's charge him up. Oh, that's so sick. Jesus, is this more? Okay. So, I'm gonna take care of this guy first because he's actually kind of weak. I'll power up. Do they all power up when you do this? I never really pay attention. Yeah, I think so. Like, they all have their mask on. Okay, power up. Jesus. This guy died? Come on. Alright. Finish it off. Is there a shield guy somewhere? Here we go. We got double, hang on. Check this out. Oh, there we go. Alright. Finally. So I feel like... So there's a boss right here coming up. So we gotta save. And do everything we can. Okay. And say I'm done with this place, man. It's too confusing. And then let's go ahead and buy some more of these. There's a resource reading near here. What All right. 
Let's see what kind of boss we're fighting in here. For sure, man. Like, I'll like there should be a boss. It doesn't look like they're storing data anywhere. I don't even see anything resembling research equipment. I think the facility is underground, but there weren't any stairs leading down from the first floor. We'll just have to comb the area ourselves. If this is where they conducted his personality rehabilitation, Nagi's data should be here. I wonder if Nagi managed to get away. I had all of you there to rescue me, but he was alone. You're still as kind as ever. Nagi! You did come back. Of course you did. I mean, we're best friends, aren't we? Looks like Nagi received even more personality rehabilitation. Because Nagi was regaining his original personality the last time we saw him? Personality rehabilitation. You traitors against glorious new Himuka are the ones who need rehabilitation, not me! There's no need to worry, Yuito. They specifically told me, you need to be alive when I bring you in! Ooh, here we go. That's kind of cool. Stop it, He's probably... I, don't want to fight you. I feel like he might transform, like, later. We have to fight this is kind of cool. Of course, I'll kill Holy fuck. I don't think this is going to be that crazy, though. Go and chop him up, I guess. He's kind of weak. But yeah, for sure he's probably going to have a second stage. Where he transform or something. Maybe not. We'll see, though. Cut him up. Where's he going? This is so cool, actually, you know? Ooh. Where's he? You know what? I'm going to use this real quick. So I'm like when I first started this game, I was expecting this game just to be like people versus monster, you know? But it's kind of cool how they have like these kind of boss fights, like human boss fights. Hang on. Keep tossing these at him. God, this thing's so busted, just running around just tossing shit at him. Holy fuck, he's hurting me. He dodging? That's crazy. What the hell? Okay, forgot I gotta pay attention to the timer, man. I almost let that go. I was just like paying attention, like I'm tossing shit at him, you know? Jesus. I'm tossing shit. Hang on, guys. We got 10 more seconds. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna be able to. Jesus, hang on. I heal. Oh, hang on. Keep going. Holy fuck. Okay, power down. Just the time, I think. This guy's crazy. Okay, let's go in with this. Chop him up. There we go. This is the basic one. Okay, that did a decent amount. Get the fuck out of him. Hang on, guys. We even pretty much need gamma for this. Like it's so hard to go in like bosses. Hang on, guys. Yeah, this guy hurts. Holy fuck! Kind of bounce. Okay, so holy fuck. So we're gonna use gamma real quick. And slice him up. Jesus, he got rid of that kind of quick. Okay, let's gonna use this. Can I hit him? I guess not. Yeah, I can't get him. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna wait for my teleportation and then Gamma to go max. And then we'll go and just finish it, I guess. Fight. Yeah, that's kind of cool. All right, I'm just gonna wait for a bit. Okay, here we go. Okay, it's over for him. He can't do much. Jesus, unless he does that bullshit. 
All right, I can't finish this. Hmm. Here we go. Let's finish this with Nabi, I guess. Oh, hang on. We're so close. Take one of these. Did he live? Okay. We got everyone this time. Yuito, I know that was scary. They're all done with the tests now. Honest. Let me see that brave face. You're okay. It's all over. Mommy! <laughs> A dream? About my mom? Why would I have that now? Oh, right. This ceiling. It looks like the hospital room from when I was a kid. This smell, too. Smell. Where am I? <laughs> huh? I can't use my powers? You can't use your powers here. Those restraints are designed to nullify your abilities. You're such a fool. All you had to do was play the patriotic hero, and you would have had the world on a platter. Who are you? Just a humble staff member of this facility. We've met a number of times when you were a child, but I'm sure you don't remember. We did? Have you forgotten about your time here in the hospital with your mother? Which means this is still somewhere inside the old OSF hospital. Where are my friends? No idea. Your friends are outside my jurisdiction. I'm in charge of duds. You mean people without powers? That's right. I was in charge of the experiments involving you and the Travers brothers. Unlike Karin and Luca, it seems like your psionic hormone levels are dropping. What? Now that I think about it, your psychokinesis was activated under some unconventional circumstances. Duds have an extremely low chance of manifesting powers in the first place. This could mean there's something special about your cerebrum. I'd like to ask you a few questions. Wait, I'm a dud? Oh, so you're missing your memories from when you were a dud too. This is going to be tricky. It seems your brain is accumulating damage as you use your power. I need to run some tests before I ask you any questions. I'm sure you've experienced episodes of sudden memory loss or having difficulty remembering your childhood. Wait! Please, explain it to me so I can understand. <sighs> it's simple. You were born a dud. Then you were hospitalized here with your mother, because this was still the OSF hospital at that time. We know that duds are capable of acquiring potent powers. The country sends all duds to this hospital, where we run medical experiments on them. I'm a dud? I had no powers? In any case, it's time to go back to sleep. Damn it! I can't stay awake. Yuito! Are you alright?
Major General Fubuki? How... The program he gave us was able to tap into the facility's surveillance camera feed. I knew it would be dangerous infiltrating this place. I made sure I would be available if something happened. Thank you very much. I'm glad you guys are all right. I'm sorry, Major General. We couldn't get Nagi's memory data. Uh, right, Nagi. What happened after that? You suddenly collapsed, and Nagi... He took you, and then used you as... as a hostage. We were afraid of hurting you, so we couldn't attack him. We were locked inside a room. There was strange equipment. I think it was for personality rehabilitation. The Major General Fubuki showed up before any of us were rehabilitated, so we're all okay. You don't have to worry about us. Sorry. You're always rescuing me. Thanks, guys. Wait. It looks like... Others are gathering. I've disconnected the alarm, but they should already know Yuito's trying to get away. We have to escape the hospital. I've already shared the way out with Wataru. I'll hold them off here. But... Don't forget, I'm a Septentrion. I can handle myself. Take this. Don't lose it. No matter what. What is it? I'll tell you when we get out of here. Now go. You'll only get in my way. Okay. I don't see any safe area near here for teleporting. We have to run. Got it. Please, be careful. Whoa, hang on. Where the hell are we? Okay, I thought that Nagi fight was gonna be... Like the end, you know? Like the chapter? But... Yeah, here we go. We got this too. This looks kinda cool. Finally! The hospital was kinda neat the first time. But it just got so confusing, <laughs> you know? I didn't like it one bit. Well, I like it a little bit, but you know. <laughs> just got a little confusing with the map. And like different like levels, floors and all that stuff. And this. Holy shit. And Nagi Fall was kinda cool. So it was kinda easy too since you have like gamma. Gamma's like really busted for boss fights and stuff. Pretty much like another health bar. That comes back hella quick, you know? There we go. You gotta get out of here. I guess that's it. Okay, hang on. We're back at the hospital. So I feel like... Are we just going... Experimental facility? That's where we came from. Let's go this way. Hmm. I wonder if... There's gonna be another boss fight. Like once we reach the exits. This one doesn't look too confusing. It's just straight out. We gotta go. Yeah, that's the exit right there, I think. Well, oh, these guys have guns. Oh, the soldier guys. Hang on, guys. Yeah, these guys are weak. They just do a lot, though. Holy fuck. These guys up. This guy got a riot shield. And we got power up already? Okay, you can't use your... Psychonesis. Oh, look at her. She's, like, jabbing that guy. <laughs> there we go. One of these. And then, there we go. He keeps saying next. Next. Former Major General Karin? Yuito, it looks like you've finally become a traitor too. What do you mean? Did the new Himuka government brand Yuito a traitor? Yes. I doubt you'd be allowed inside Suo. <sighs> Come to Seiron. You'll all be accepted as one of them. You're asking us to help Seiron, the same people who are sticking human brains inside others? Meanwhile, New Himuka is conducting experiments to metamorphose humans all in the name of producing a strong power. And at its center is the great city Suo. They're both twisted. They're both crazy. Then what do you want to do? Run to the religious fanatics in Togetsu? They're a religious state. They'd probably be open to taking in criminals such as yourselves. 
But Togetsu won't necessarily be a safe place this time around. This time? Just a figure of speech. Yeah. New Himoka won't be able to get us in Togetsu. They're an independent city. It is a little shady, though. Is that why you came here, Karin? To tell us this? <laughs> it was just an afterthought. However, take this if you're going to Togetsu. I can't drink this. I won't. Whether it's human blood or brains, you need to drink it if you want to live. Either way, you'll lose all your memories and powers if you choose to do nothing. The drugs are simply giving you time, so you have to drink it whether you like it or not. He's up to something. But what is it? Most likely saving Pabuki. Should we be helping him? No. Come back to the hideout. Major General Fubuki wanted me to tell you not to worry about him. Besides, I can at least monitor his status from here. Come back so we can make a plan on whether we're helping him or running to Togetsu. All right. Hey, good job, everyone. Man, this unit's so cozy. Wataru, what are you doing here? I had a meeting with Major General Fubuki. I was supposed to escape to the hideout if they found out you guys snuck into the old hospital in Lokusho. I mean, I can navigate you anywhere as long as I have a PC and sign at. Which means that Fubuki predicted Yuito would be branded a traitor. So, he told Wataru to come here, since he is Yuito Platoon's operator. If they're going to make Yuito the bad guy, it makes sense to take out the person who knows what Yuito Platoon is up to. Good thing Wataru got here when he did. Otherwise, they may have subjected him to personality rehabilitation. Yep, that's basically it. I made sure they didn't know where this hideout was before I left. This was originally a unit for the Sumeragi family. It'd be bad if Chief Kaito found out we're here. But it seems like we're fine for now. I haven't told my brother that we're using this unit, but we should be careful. We own many others, so I don't think they'd find this place right away. In any case, I can't believe my brother made me into a traitor. Yuito... It's really made it clear to me that he sided with the government. Not that I didn't already know that. Anyway, since I'll be staying here from now on, rest assured that nobody will find this hideout. More importantly, do you still have the thing Major General Fubuki gave you? I have it, right here. What is it? It's for Arahabaki, a one-time-use key code generator. Why would he give something that important to... Major General Fubuki entrusted the key code generator to you because he thought he might not come back alive. Have you heard anything from him? I've tracked him leaving the old OSF hospital. He completely disappeared from all systems after that. I hope he hasn't been captured by the government. My brother saved Fubuki. I'm sure of it. We have nothing to worry about. That reminds me. I wonder if it's true that former Major General Karin and Luca were both duds. I'll look for him on my end, too. Besides, you guys don't have the luxury of worrying about anyone. They're calling you demons and hypocrites in Suo. Our stocks are limited. If you don't make contact with Togetsu or Seiron soon, we're gonna run out of supplies. How could they do this? They were just hailing him as a hero. It's fine. They shouldn't have been calling me a hero in the first place. There's actually something I wanted to tell all of you. It seems that I was born without powers. <laughs> but you have powers. What are you saying? You know how I was being treated at the old OSF hospital as a kid? Seems like I was subjected to an experiment that caused me to acquire my power. I think the reason why my powers have been on the fritz lately is because they were artificially engineered. It probably puts a huge strain on my mind. Are you sure you're okay with telling us this? That you used to be a dud? Oh, is he sensitive about having been a dud? I mean, hiding it doesn't change the truth. And I figured you all deserve to know, considering all the trouble my unstable power caused you. 
It's no trouble. Really. Yeah, we're just worried about you. It's only natural for us to worry. But thank you for telling us. I've heard there are many people without powers who live their life suffering in secret. It's sad, but I do believe that is the case. And if something ever happens, you know we have your back. Thanks. All right. We should rest here a little bit and figure out what to do next. Probably be impossible to recover Nagi's memory data now. I guess this means Major General Fubuki's plan will have to be put on hold. Alright, so yeah, probably end the video here. Probably get some coffee and then hop back on. I wanna check who messaged us first. Hang on. Oh, this guy. Hmm. So we'll probably do that when I start the next video. Um yeah, go ahead and save, and then we'll be back on this in a bit. So you were admitted to this hospital when you were little as part of an experiment on duds? I can't believe they locked kids in a hospital to experiment on them. Must have been scary. That's unforgivable. I don't really remember it, but thanks for worrying about me. I want to check. Oh yeah, because we have Bond episode for her, and then we have Gammas. That's going to be cool. I can't believe Suo is after me. I don't know if I should go to Togetsu or Seiron, but what Seiron is doing is unforgivable. Alright, so, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll probably end it. I'll see you guys in a bit.